Hi, I'm Dr Fiona Wood and I've spent 20 years treating nasty scalds and burns. Too many of them have been children. Kids seem to be attracted to danger like moths to a flame. But trust me, the best treatment for burns is to prevent them from happening. So here's a few tips to help keep children safe from burns in and around your home. Hot food and drinks are the leading cause of burns and scalds, so it's best never to have small children in the kitchen when you're cooking. Phew, that was close. Oh, and you should never hold a child while preparing or consuming hot foods or drinks. The bathroom is another place to keep safe from scalds and burns. Never have running water unattended and always test the water temperature before you let them get in. A good tip is to run cold water at the beginning and last so it cools the spout. It's best to set your thermostat on your hot water system to 50 degrees maximum to keep risks to a minimum. Always turn taps off tightly so little hands can't turn them on themselves. Smoke alarms save lives. So make sure you have them installed and replace the batteries on April the 1st every year. Test each one. Install guards around fires and heaters. They should always be used. Even better, constantly supervise children around fires and heaters. If the unthinkable happens and your child receives burns or scalds, administering first aid immediately will reduce the severity. If clothes are wet, take them off so heat can escape. Immediately run the burn or scald under cool running water for at least 20 minutes. Never use ice, oils, butter, ointments or creams. Then keep the child warm and seek medical advice. Remember, prevention is the best cure we have. And always look out for hazards and keep your kids safe. For more information, visit kidssafewa.com.au.